Well, my uh, interest in Project V as part of Boxcar was really a way to revisit the idea behind the original Vagina Monologues by Eve Ensler. When Eve set out to make the Vagina Monologues, she interviewed thousands and thousands of women, giving them a voice about their, their sexuality, their bodies, their vaginas. And I really wanted to revisit that idea in a fresh way. Women who were not just ordinary women, who were performers, who had an artistic voice. And what would they have to say about their vaginas, their experience with their vaginas through their different genres. So we've got stand-up comics, we've got a puppeteer, we've got writers, poets, a dancer. Um, and how would these performers use their unique voices and art forms to, to really talk about the same thing, um, which I think is really still vitally important to be talked about. We made the decision to combine these new art forms with some of the original uh, vagina monologues, partly as a sort of a, a grounding thing for the audience. People know the vagina monologues, they know what they're about, they know what their purpose is. And so we felt the audience, it would allow them to connect with the new art forms a little bit easier with that sort of sense of familiarity. And also just to, to pay homage to the original, um, the original idea, the, the precursor. We're taking a new take on it, but we are still um, wanting to validate the original experience. People should come see Project V because there is still so much violence against women in the world. Sex slavery is, it's still a huge, huge issue. Um, and the reason why Eve first did the vagina monologues was to help combat violence against women. And so in our small way, we're also trying to help that. It's, it's a message that's been said before but needs to keep on being said until until these atrocities don't go on anymore. So I think it's, it's very important that people come and see it. How hard we try.